I wake up and what do I hear? The familiar and haunting raspy voice of fear. It switches on like a coffee maker in my mind. And then it's only a matter of time till it starts brewing my special blend overflowing past the line. For I forgot to put a filter in again so every little bit starts pouring in and splashing around in my head like an ocean that slams and smashes into rock and stone before I even get out of bed. Am I the only one or does this sound familiar to any of you out there? Because for me, it feels like the moment I open my eyes, the loop of deceitful lies instantly starts to appear. And then the authority in my mind becomes my guide with the combined energy of shame, guilt, depression, and fear. I'm sure there are a few out there who feel as I do, but I'm not saying that my specific experience pertains to any of you. But according to scientific research and proof, all our thoughts this whole time have been running and operating on a continuous loop. That means that most of our lives we haven't been creating or generating anything new. It's just more and more of a unique coffee blend made specific to you that's being constantly recycled and reused. And I believe to have the life that you dream of comes from your state of being. So what can we do to break free from this loop so we can have new thoughts, beliefs, and feelings? We must put our awareness energy and intention into overdrive the moment we open our eyes by replacing those memorized thoughts, feelings, and beliefs that have been in charge this whole time and take them out of the body and up into the mind. For in the body is where the past has stored our feelings like a vault without a door and to reach inside we must dig down deep beneath and come up through the floor. Then once inside, we'll realize that it's just tricks of the mind to survive in the big scary world out there and then we'll start to see, with a new pair of eyes, a world with nothing to fear. Then we get to decide what goes into our mind, and over time, with enough persistence, focus, and desire, the first sounds we will hear can contain the sounds of a harmonious gospel choir echoing in our mind. And then through the rhythm of life, our hearts and mind will be working together, pulsing and firing at the same time. Then each morning when we wake, we won't hear the ocean crashing at the break or feel our bones tremble and shake from the weight of an authority. And instead, a new blend will be circling inside our head as we lay peacefully in our bed, letting this new aroma invigorate all our senses, like drinking in a drop of honey and earth the finest, purest, and most intoxicating cup of tea. <laughs>